Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel. In today's video, I'll be showing you how to add a video in Elementor in 2023. Of course, Elementor is a powerful WordPress page builder that allows you to create a visually appealing website. So in this tutorial, we'll guide you through the steps to add a video to your Elementor design page. So let's get started. Before we start with this video, make sure to watch us from now till the end so you have full experience. So first, let's just make sure that you have the Elementor installed and activated on your WordPress website. So open whatever browser you want. And of course, make sure to access your WordPress. Go to the dashboard and then you will find on this left panel plugins. Go to plugins and make sure that you have Elementor. If you don't have the Elementor plugin, you can simply click on add a new plugin. Search for Elementor, install and activate it. And once it's, you have it, go to pages, go to add a new page. Go and click on Elementor and you will find yourself right here. And of course, once you are here, make sure to go and get the Elementor Pro because without it, you'll like a lot of features. So as you can see here, there's the plans. You can go and check the price by your own and even the features for that. So for us, we are just going to get started. So of course, if you want to get or add a video widget, we can simply go to this list panel. And of course, once we have our widgets here, if we don't have it, you can simply go and add one. So once we have our widgets, you can simply go to this list panel and drag the video out here. And of course, we'll be able to add a video depending on the link that we put here so simply you can go and uh, change the link to whatever video you have on your youtube or as you can see venmo daily motion self or even self-hosted if you click on self-hosted you will have to go and upload something from your pc as example so let me just go and upload this one and of course, uh, this video has exceeded, exceeded the maximum upload uh, size for this site because that's, again, because I don't have Elementor Pro. So for you, make sure to go and get it. And of course, you'll be able to add your video from YouTube, Venmo, Dailymotion, or if you're from your PC. You can even go and choose the starter time, end time. You can choose if you want it to autoplay, mute, loop, or you can even go and choose if you want to have a download button. Of course, we will even go and get through that uh, through this video. I'm coming back into uh, into that through through this video so make sure to stick by so other than that of course you'll be able to do a lot of other stuff on elementor including like here uh, adding like as an example if you want to add some intersection you can simply drag it here into uh, this section as an example so let's just drag it and as you can see you'll be able to edit the layout of it as you can see we can edit the content width the width of the uh, layout of course the columns gap uh, height vertical lines overflow html tag and of course even the structure of it if you want to we'll be able even to edit that so of course other than that we'll be able to edit the style of it as an example so we can change uh, the background of it uh, we can uh, give it a uh, like normal background or hover background uh, there's the even the background overlay option the border the sh the shape divider and of course the typography also so you can go and also to this advanced and here you will be able to uh, edit the margins the paddings depending on whatever you want of course and this z index uh, css id css classes will just simply edit those margins uh, for you and of course here there is this motion effect that you can edit also responsive uh, attributes and custom css and of course as you can see those will require pro also so uh, of course you'll be able even to add some hidden as an example you can simply just drag it down in there get your hidden here as an example i'm just going to type test here you can even go and even paste the link if you want like this uh, hidden to be clickable you can even edit the sides uh, html tag alignment of it so you can do basically what you want with it you can even change the style of it including color typography uh, text stroke uh, text shadow and the blend mode and of course here on the advanced uh, option we will be able to edit the loud of it the motion effect transform background border mask responsive attributes and the custom css also and of course other than that we have this image so we can simply go and add our image by clicking here on image we'll be able to upload some files from our pc as an example so let me just go here and example and upload this file and as you can see you'll be able to upload it and we can even change the scale of this 
uh, file or this image however we want we can even align it to the light rift uh, middle we can even get at some caption a link as an example uh, and we can even go and edit this image of it uh, the image width as an example the max width if you want to the he the height and of course we'll be able even to change the objects fit uh, the uh, it would like to be normal or hover css filters will be will be able to apply some and of course on this advanced we'll be able to edit all of those stuff i don't have to go through them again and of course we have here the text editor example we'll be able to go and add some text if you want to and edit the content of it the style of it and even here we have the advanced options so the style is normally going to be the alignment text color typography and text shadow as usual content here we can go and do whatever we want with this as you can see here and that's normally going to be it here of course you'll be able to add some videos as examples so let me just go and drag it here so if you click on this video as you can see you can link a video from youtube if you want to, you can link it from Vimeo or Dailymotion or even self-hosted if you're gonna uh, upload it from your PC as an example. So as an example, let's just go here and see we are going to upload something from YouTube. So simply you'll have to go and paste the link right here. Once you do so, the video will appear here and you'll be able to play it whenever you want, even fix the uh, play speed, the quality of it, and of course the volume and or anything else that you want to edit. So of course, if you click on it, that will open it even on YouTube as an example, and you'll be able even to watch it on YouTube directly. So of course, you can even use this navigator from here to go back and edit whatever you want if you want to. And of course, as you can see, the video will be able mm, to even edit some options of it if you wanted to auto play, if you wanted to be mute if you wanted to loop if you want uh, to have some player control or if you don't want people to have player control uh, the mode is branding privacy mode and of course there's even the style so here it's just gonna be uh, the size of the video as you can see so if you put it like this it depending just on the size of the video how it's gonna be so you'll have to go and put it the size that you want you can even go and add some css filters and of course on this advanced uh, button or option you'll find the same advanced uh, options as you can see here you'll be able to edit the margins the padding with position and a lot of other stuffs here other than that of course you'll be able to add some buttons so buttons will work as an example so as an example you'll be able to edit text so i'm just going to type here test again and of course you can paste here the link and if someone click on this test right here they will be taken to the link that you put here and of course you can even choose the alignment of it the type of it as an example and size the icon you can go and upload like some icon from yourself the icon space in and of course you'll be able to edit the style and a lot of other stuff and then we have the divider spacer and those like kind of the same thing so you can go and try them out and of course we have even this google maps option this option will let you as an example let me just go and add it here you will be able to add like the location that you want in google maps you can simply go and add the location here and that's gonna be it and of course the icon simply you can go and add whatever icon you want edit the style of it and edit any advanced option that you want also and you will normally be good to go so if you reached this point of the video, congratulations, you've successfully added a video in Elementor in 2023. Remember to optimize your videos for like fast loading and consider the overall design and user experience for your page. So thank you for watching and if you liked this video, make sure to leave a like down below and subscribe to our channels for more helpful tutorials like this one. And I will see you in the next video.